The old, decrepit amusement park stood silent in the moonlight, its rusty rides long abandoned by the town. But there was one thing that still lived within its desolate confines, the legend of the screeching clown. Every child in town had heard the stories, and we dared each other to venture into the park at night. Nobody ever did, until one fateful summer night, my friends and I decided we were brave enough. The moon hung low in the sky as we crept through the overgrown path leading to the park's entrance. A feeling of dread gnawed at our stomachs, but we couldn't back down now. The wind whispered eerie secrets through the twisted trees. Inside, the park was a maze of long-forgotten laughter. Dilapidated carnival games and rickety rides cast long, eerie shadows. But we weren't alone. As we made our way through the ghostly park, a distant, high-pitched screeching sound pierced the night. Goosebumps rippled across my skin and I glanced at my friends, their faces pale with fear. It's the screeching clown, someone whispered, their voice trembling. We followed the chilling sound deeper into the park, our flashlights cutting through the darkness. It led us to an old, crumbling circus tent, tattered and weather-worn. The screeching grew louder and we hesitated at the tent's entrance. Inside, an unsettling sight awaited us. A life-sized clown mannequin stood in the centre, its grotesque face painted in garish colours. Its eyes seemed to follow us as if it were alive. And there, hanging from a rusty hook on the wall, was a tattered clown costume stained with something that looked disturbingly like blood. The screeching reached a crescendo, filling the air with a haunting, discordant melody. It was then that we noticed the source, a music box that had begun playing on its own, its handle slowly turning. No one had touched it. Suddenly, the clown mannequin twitched, its painted grin stretching impossibly wide. Its eyes blazed with malevolence, and it lunged toward us with a terrifying screech. Panic-stricken, we stumbled backward, knocking over the music box. The clown's screeching laughter merged with the music's haunting tune, creating a nightmarish cacophony. We bolted from the tent, hearts pounding, and didn't stop until we were out of the park, gasping for breath. The screeching followed us, echoing through the night, but eventually it faded into the distance. The legend of the screeching clown had come to life that night, and we had been its unwitting audience. We never dared to return to the abandoned amusement park, and the chilling memory of that haunted clown's laughter still haunts my dreams to this day.